Here's a video shot of 387 Autumn Trail. Lot 24 in the meadows on the 6th of May. So this area right here has been cleared. Uh, plenty large enough for a good size home to be put up in here. It's uh, quite level. Could either go with uh, a crawl space or a uh, daylight basement depending on the uh, owner's preference. So we're standing about midway, I would estimate uh, maybe 300 feet, a little more from the road. The, uh, the property goes back uh, another three, 400 feet up the ridge, uh, 700 feet total. And as you can see, uh, completely uh, uh, open as far as no uh, no buildings will exist either side of this property just uh, past the truck in the distance is uh, what the closest house would be and then uh, I don't even know if you can detect the roof of that house just uh, ahead would be the house to the left. But as far as over here on this side, uh, once again, uh, it would just be wooded space, beautiful uh, hardwood trees in here. Uh, creates a, a great canopy even now early in the spring. You can see the leaves starting to set in on these trees, which are just about 100% hardwood trees. It's a beautiful area. Um, in the distance, uh, probably difficult to see in this video, you can see the mountain ridge. I'm not sure if that's Signal Mountain or uh, Lookout Mountain. Potentially, you can see both. So what we're going to do is uh, we're going to go ahead and get in the uh, vehicle and uh, keep the video going as we go down the driveway. We'll see as we uh, get just uh, about maybe 100 feet from here where there's a natural drainage ditch that uh, is right now on our right side. Uh, and it cuts across this property, which uh, largely contributed in my estimation of why nobody built on it. And uh, I obtained a building permit and put in a... Uh, tile or otherwise known as culvert, I um, believe four feet that uh, now gives access to this area here. We will uh, we'll proceed. So bear with me while I get the Seat belt on to quiet this down, and then uh, also looks like I'm in low four wheel drive. Okay, so now no more complaints from the vehicle, and we'll go ahead and uh, drive slowly so you'll get a feel for the property as we drive down and uh, go across. This uh, little bridge area that was put in, I think it uh, came out pretty nice. Which uh, gives, gives access to the building site we were just on. So I will I'll pause and we'll look over to the, uh, the house that's on the right as we uh, drive out. Of course, it would be on the left driving in. And uh, still kind of difficult to see the house that's on the uh, on the left of us. So the, quite unique as far as this, uh, you'd be in a subdivision yet again, almost have uh, your private private uh, building site here. So you can kind of see the uh, ditch, not so much. So it comes across and uh, and then dips dips down into the area and goes over to this house which you can see this next house is much lower 
still can't really see it. We will here in a moment. So let me get up uh, at this point. We're just about even with the house that's set back the furthest. It's over here. We can now see it. So they're probably back. I don't even know if it's 200 feet, but maybe 200. And we've gone back probably another 100 beyond that at, at least. You can see the, uh, the house across the street. And now this house still kind of difficult to see. You should be able to uh, detect the, uh, the roof of the house and uh, maybe even the fence that it has in the backyard. So that house you can see is down pretty low. You're way up above it. It uh, won't obstruct any, any aspect of your view. And then here we uh, will continue down. This, uh, this property has had a uh, recent survey done on it. The interesting thing was uh, it was done by David Matthews. The guys that did the survey did the original survey of this subdivision years ago, and they found all the original pins that they had put in other than, as a matter of fact, one of the guys on the survey team was in that original crew, and they found all the pins except one straight ahead which the uh, power transformer uh, was put right on top of it. So we, uh, we proceed down. You can see it uh, makes for a beautiful driveway. The, uh, the traffic here is pretty light. And uh, we've pretty much uh, concluded our tour. The, uh, the property proceeds uh, from this sidewalk here to the right of us, over about 10 feet from us, to, uh, to where the sidewalk begins, over here to our left. So uh, that will conclude our video. and. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, please follow up with the, uh, the property listing. Thank you.